this is Valerie from MyRainbowCoalition.blogspot.com, and I am here today with a haul video that includes the January 2014 main kit from Gossamer Blue. I won this kit from Lane Amen during one of her scrapbook improv events, so thank you so much, Lane and Gossamer Blue, for this excellent gift. Um, I want to start with this, and I know that there's going to be a little bit of glare, but the kit comes in a um, Ziploc bag, and then it has the little color scheme that is included in the kit, and their cute little Gossamer Blue label. Right. I'm going to start with the embellishments. The first thing is this American Craft. Um, sycamore photograph overlays. So they have a whole bunch of them. It looks like they said 14 different photo overlays. I've never tried these photo overlays before. I I don't know. I I just <laughs> it just never seemed like something that it would appeal to me. But it's nice to have my hands on them, and maybe I'll find out that I like. Them a lot. Um, the next we have these vellum stars from Studio Calico, and they're not just vellum; they're also self adhesive. So they're all these cute little doodled stars that you can stick on to your layouts, and they'll look like they've been doodled on the layout. Then we have a simple stories ephemera pack from the Daily Grind Collection, and I don't know if you can see that, but it's got uh, Days of the Week labels, and file tabs, arrows, lots of arrows, and I love arrows, um, little label arrows, uh, die cuts that say now, today, and daily, little journaling spots and a Viewmaster, and I love my Viewmasters, so I think this is going to be a really fun little pack to work with. And this is Zazz, it's like, um, Stickles, but looks like American Crafts version of Stickles. And then we have Daily Fash Pins from October Afternoon, it says, just saying, seriously, let's do this, true story, hi, and good time. It was really cute. Um, and then the last of the embellishments, I guess it's not truly an embellishment, but I like to think of them as embellishments, are the stamps. And this is an exclusive um, stamp set from L Studio for Gossamer Blue, and it's a little label and a um, couple different textures on the little banner, and it says, Photo Love, check this out, you make me smile, and a date. So that'll be nice and useful. All right, now we're going to look at the papers. So this first paper is from Studio Calico, and it's from their print shop collection, and these are some of my favorite colors in the world, as you can tell by the color of my nails. I love, love, love these colors. Grays and beige and yellow and this teal, bluey, greeny color. It's my feet, so I'm going to love that. This is October Afternoon, Apple Cider and Bonfire from the Daily Flash Collection. So this is apple cider on this side. This is a Simple Stories Cut Apart Sheet. And I always think it's interesting the proportions that Simple Stories uses on their Cut Apart Sheets, especially their border ones. They're different than any of the other companies that I see. So uh, this is, looks like a 4 by 12. Looks like about a 2 by 12, a 2 by 12. It looks like all the rest of them are 2 by 12. So that's cute. It's Simple Stories from Daily Grind Collection. I really like 
those. I might actually punch them out and use them as little embellishments. This is pink paisley. It's called Double Dutch. It's got little kisses and hearts. That'll good, be good for Valentine's Day. Um, nice versatile chevron print and cute little floral. It says Hey Gorgeous on it. Here we have another cut apart sheet from Simple Stories Daily Grind, and I just love the rainbow colors and the little graphs and beach bubble, insta-love, um, people we love, places we go, things we do. So, very cool. And here's the back. I hate when it's something like this, but I love both sides of them. I might have to work this into Project Life that I'll use both sides. I don't always use both sides of the cards in the Project Life, but sometimes I just love them so much that I try to make them work. This is Studio Calico, and it is from the Print Shop Collection again. This side has some doodled stars on an aqua background, and this side I kind of love them both, but I really love this side. It's a sketched floral print, and it's white. It's beige on white, and I think that I will be taking my gelatos and my water brush and coloring in a lot of these, and I might even use that as a background that way, just coloring in certain flowers that I want to call attention to. This is from October Afternoon Daily Flash Collection. Uh, this is called Corn Maze. Oh, it's a large plaid, I guess you call that, and then a uh, mustard, gray, and beige floral print on the other side. This is a Gossamer Blue exclusive by Tracy Reed, who is traditionally a digital scrapbook designer, but um, but she's partnered with Gossamer Blue to do some papers with her and with them. And I really like hexagon. And again, that whole color scheme, I just I just love. And you see, matches right up with my nails. And then a really nice versatile. Um, craft and black stripe on the back. And this is why I was so excited to get this kit in the first place. This, my dear friend, is another exclusive for Gossamer Blue by a digital scrapbook designer, Pepper Granberg of One Little Bird Design. This paper is called Pieces of Me, and I like it. I'm not going to say it's like my favorite paper ever, but I'm totally a peppermint fan girl, so I'm very excited to have my hands on this and actually be touching peppermint paper because I have a whole bunch of crickets and I just love her and I think she's great. So I'm very excited to, to have some peppermint paper and it's a nice light uh, grid pattern on the back. This is from Pink Paisley, um, called Marco Polo. It says, hey dude, oh boy, I must ask you a question. I'm not into the mustaches. I will probably cut this apart, or at least get rid of those mustaches somehow. Cover them up, maybe. Or maybe I'll just use this other side, <laughs> which has um, graph paper and some stars on the chevron border. Both stitching. And then this is a Simple Story sticker sheet. And we've got two alphas, or four alphas, in three different sizes, four different colors. And then you have just some little different stickers, some little saying, fun, we are here today, things we do, love you, and Amber Stand. Um, Small labels, love the everyday. 
Lots of cute things and just love the bright rainbow colors. And then now we're down to the cardstock and you get one, two, three, four, four sheets of cardstock and a sheet of chipboard. It's probably just, you know, so that the pieces won't get bent, but definitely useful. And there's this mustard yellow, a white, an orange, and a teal. And so I think those are going to work great for, with the kit. And I'm looking forward to using it. So um, let me know what you think of this new camera that I'm using. The problem that I had before was that I was using my DSLR camera and while I love it and love the quality of the video and the sound quality, it um, the battery life is really bad. Um, so until I get my hands on an AC adapter for it, I think I'm going to be using this Polaroid Z23 that I can plug in um, the AC adapter. So let me know if the video is just so horrible you can't even stand to watch it. And I'll go back to my DSLR. Um, anyway, I'm really excited to use this kit. Thank you so much to Gossamer Blue and Lane Eamon for giving it to me. It's great. And um, thank you so much for watching. You can find me and everything that I do with this kit at myrainbowcoalition.blogspot.com. Thanks for watching.